back to work. I just loaded 20 sheets of 7 16 OSB onto the roof or onto the second, third floor. <sighs> work, work, work. I fixed the roof. I went to see a roofer. Yeah, $90,000. I'll try to patch it for now. I went online, YouTube video, and I learned how to test the solenoid for the lockup. And the positive wire is this one. And you check to see if air goes through which is an oil control valve, and I'm going to use air. So I'll test it this way, energized. Air goes through, disconnect it, and no air should go through. Air still goes through. Now I forget which way was which. Was it normally open or normally closed? Tell me I gotta pull the pan off that parts tranny that's next to the barn. I didn't think this thing was working. Yep. I gotta pull the pan off that tranny. Oh god. Crappy solenoid. Yep. It's dumping oil or not dumping oil, whatever it does. Alrighty, that's what I gotta do. I'm tighten the valve body. Bolts are all finger tight. Get her done. Alright, it wasn't so bad. I just hoisted this thing up. Got oil dripping. Hoisted it up. Ah! Bolts aren't tight, which is a good thing. Crack off the pan. Get any bolts, did I? Nope. Yep. Forgot one. I saw a picture of a guy who pried the heads off a small block Chevy <laughs> with some wedges because he forgot to take the lower roll, roll bolts off. <laughs> I busted the head into two. Kind of like butterflying your filet mignon. Oh, yeah. Yummy. No water in here, at least. Of brass. Expected a lot worse. Huh, this one's got the second apply servo. I read that on the internet. That's the second apply servo. Sitting at 90 degrees with an oil line. I don't have that on mine. That switch is in a different place. Wait a minute. Oh, this is the second apply servo. That's the second apply. What's this thing then? I've got a steel plate here. Huh. Extra parts. External oil line. And where is the oil filter? Wait a second. No oil filter. Huh? I didn't pull this pan. I don't think. No. There's the throttle valve. Anyhow, I need that solenoid right there. Right there. Why is there no oil filter? No indentation here for the filter. The guy was driving it. The kid was driving the truck until he went off-roading and dumped it and seized the motor. Hmm. All right. All right. Boy, this tranny is a lot different. Mine has two oil switches, one there and one there. This one's got an offset mini switch on a little bracket. It's got this mounted on an angle where I have that steel plate and no filter. Hmm. But I've wired everything up. So 
let's see if I got juice. Yep. And set the camera down here. Let's see if I can make something happen. Lots of sand here. I wonder if I'm going to hear the transmission make a sound. That solenoid. Nothing. low point of my driveway. All the sand's been collecting under this tranny. Whee! Sand everywhere. 